Hi and welcome to our YouTube video series. Uh, it's a bit of an amateur production, not going to be as fancy as our TV adverts, even though those still come into some criticism in South Africa. You should really compare them against international adverts. American attorneys are all just in front of a blue screen with a few little bits of text on it and everything else. But anyway, people have a go at our adverts and I'll tell you about that later and show you some of those spoof videos about us. Hi. I'm not Michael De Brolio. Because if it wasn't your fault, it shouldn't be your problem. Not that they really upset me at all. In fact, I guess one should be happy that one gets publicity and I should be happy that we're the firm that people talk about. Um, it's also because I suppose I have a bit of an outspoken approach. But quite honestly, if I was going to choose an attorney, I want somebody who's outspoken. I want somebody who's going to speak on my behalf. I don't want the quiet church mouse who you've never heard of that doesn't advertise and gets their business from who knows where by phoning you when you're lying in your hospital bed and getting touts to pieces of paper for you. So we're going to deal with a lot of controversial issues in this video series, but you're also going to get to see my staff, many of whom have been with me for many years and are the absolute strength of the business and the rock on which it is built. We'll talk about a few things like that, but we're also going to take you through some more boring things. For example, in this episode, we are going to be dealing with how the claims process works and how it goes through the different departments. And that's not necessarily going to be exciting, but at the end of the video, we're also going to tell you a little bit about my horses. During this series, I'm going to focus on what I think is going to be my star of the next year, a beautiful filly called Dazzling Sun. Um, bought from the collection of Marcus Eusters horses of Steinhoff um, when they were all put up for auction and I think she's going to be a superstar and one to follow but I want this to be not just about law and not just about our practice but about me and about some of the staff that work for me and show you for example how are we dealing with things in COVID-19 how the whole world as we know has moved to video and so have our courts and have adapted remarkably well so i hope that it's going to be educational for you i hope that it's going to be entertaining and that you manage to sit through them i am the first point of contact at the firm so i'd like to make sure that you feel comfortable speaking to me of the ordeal that you've gone through We are the second stage in the claim process. We deal with the clients after they've consulted with the, our consultants. We do all opening letters to clients, police stations, traffic departments. We get your forms and your accident reports and your registration certificates and then we lodge your claim with the RAF. So litigation deals with your different kinds of pleadings. It deals with your bundles. We deal with medical doctors. We deal with getting their reports, the joint minutes, and all the other notice of intention to defend, summons. So the most important thing in our firm is to work with deadlines. What we do in our department is we make all the appointments for our clients and we assist our clients with getting to and from their appointments. We arrange all the doctor's appointments and we send all the notifications and we do all the medico work that comes in with appointments. So how the experts are appointed is according to the client's injuries, okay? Sometimes the client won't even know about certain injuries that they might have. And one of the experts have picked it up. And then once I've gone through that report, I realize they actually have further injuries, which means further experts. And from there, it will build up more experts and more experts according to the client's injuries. A lot of our clients think that their matter ends when they receive their first payment capital, but that is only the beginning of their matter, as there can be also an interim settlement or a quantum capital settlement. Once a matter has been settled, the file will be sent to my department, where I will make sure all invoices and accounts are included in this file so that it can be sent off to the cost consultants for the taxation process. When um, payment is paid by Rodex and Fun, it's our 
a responsibility and job to make sure that we allocate that payment correctly to the correct meta. Law Society give us a month to pay our clients, but we pay our clients a lot faster. We try to pay them in a period of 7 to 14 working days, sometimes in even quicker than that. We receive payments from Rodex and Fund, we allocate payments to the correct matters, and we pay our clients. That's the most important part of our job. <laughs> I have owned racehorses since 2002, and some years I have less running and in other years more. This year I have four that are racing, and Dazzling Sun is the one we expect to be the best. She is based in Cape Town with the Snaiths, and we think she is likely to win her next race and we'll cover that race in the next episode. So far, my biggest success in racing is winning the Summer Cup, one of South Africa's three biggest races, two years in a row with Master Sabina. Master Sabina still got five to make up, juxtaposed, trying her best. It's Liege who hits the front. Master Switch is right there. The conglomerate is in the mix and he's beginning to shine up. Here's the conglomerate. Master Sabina, then comes Master Switch. Liege at the inside. The conglomerate, Master Sabina with tons of heart, barges way through and he goes back to back. Master Sabina wins. The conglomerate second. Then came Master Switch, Liege, juxtaposed and Saratoga Dancer. Master Sabina has won the Gauteng Sansui Summer Cup for the second year running. What a soldier, what a servant, and what character he's shown today by barging through the narrowest of gaps.